One minute for Mrs Boss for the EFDD group. Thank you. Thank you, Madam President. There are tens of thousands of cases of FGM in the UK, and not one person has been uh, brought to justice. It's the failed policy of multiculturalism which has given rise to this abomination across the UK. In the UK, elected officials and representatives have turned a blind eye to this practice in order not to offend minority communities and avoid being labelled as racist. Lack of integration within these communities and a political class too afraid to speak out are allowing this practice to continue. It is these people who have let down the thousands of young girls and women butchered in the name of a backward cultural custom. This evil practice must end. Politicians and the justice system must have the courage to act. Protecting children has to take priority over zealous and outdated political correctness. Now, Mrs. Bors, there's a blue card question for you. But I think we would like to limit them today. But could you accept this card? Would you accept a blue card? Mrs. Bearder. Uh, the, our UKIP MEP, that more must be done to tackle FGM, including in Europe. But why then did UKIP refuse to vote in favour of the European Parliamentary Resolution December 13, which strongly condemns uh, FGM? UKIP, I think, would uh, do better to put, put their anti-EU ideology aside and realise that working together sometimes is the best way to change the world for the better. Well, I actually wasn't here when, when that was tabled. I'm a new MEP. Um, but the Liberal Democrats have a great big load of guilt to take on their shoulders with their failed policy of multiculturalism and political correctness. So I think, actually, that question from you is an absolute disgrace. Yeah, there we go. Here, here.